What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Carolina David, coming at you with a quick little vlog. I want to say real quick, those that believe in the, in the Trinity, that God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit, and those that believe that Jesus is God, and those that believe in Jesus only, all of you all, all of you all basically believe in the same thing. Let me explain. Okay, those that believe that in the Trinity, God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit, you believe that God, the Almighty, had when sent his only begotten Son, which is the Spirit of God inside of Jesus, so that will make Jesus being God, and then you believe that when Jesus had departed, that the Holy Spirit is God as well. The comforter that was left with us is God as well. So you basically believe so you basically believe that God is all three. And then if you look at the Jesus only, they basically believe the same thing. They believe that God is Jesus and that the Holy Spirit even is God, which is Jesus. And then if you look at the uh, Jesus is God believers, they basically believe the same thing as well, that God is Jesus, which Jesus, when he walked this earth, that's why they say that when he come in his father's name, which is the name Jesus, and they believe that the spirit of God was implanted in was implanted into Jesus, and that when he said, this is my son in whom I'm well pleased, they believe that that was God speaking of himself being in Jesus. And they also believe that the Holy Spirit, which is with us, is the spirit of Jesus, like coming back basically to be the comforter. So my thing is this, why are we all having this you know, argument in a sense that about Jesus being God and everything like that. Why, like, but now me, I believe, I believe differently. I believe that God is the Father, the Almighty God, that Jesus is the Lord, the King of Kings, Lord of Lords, and that the Holy Spirit is which what it is, the Holy Spirit, the Comforter. I believe that it's only one true God. That's the Father. And then the Son, Jesus Christ, is the Lord, the King of kings, Lord of lords. That's why when he come back, it's going to be written upon his vesture. And then the Holy Spirit is that what it is, the Holy Spirit. Now, if you disagree, let's talk. But in all realness, all of you all believe the same thing. And to me, and, and not, I ain't gonna say to me, but according to the scripture, that is actually wrong. Because if you look at the scripture from the Old Testament up until the New, and even then on, it continually said that Jesus is the Son of God. Jesus called himself the Son. And in the Old Testament, it said things like, God is a God who shall not lie. So was the son of man, which we know the son of man is Jesus, who shall not repent. So basically saying that the son of man, which is the son of God, that, you know, it spoke of him then. And even the spirit, the, the spirit of God, that's why even like well, I guess the Holy Spirit was even alive and well back then as well, because when it says that, my spirit shall not be amongst them. You know, my, my spirit shall not be with man always. What was that? The spirit of, the, basically the Holy Spirit. It's speaking of the Holy Spirit. That's why the lifespan of man had been cut down from, like, being able to live from a thousand years or 900 some odd years or whatever to only being able to live 120 years. But anyway, I just want to do that quick little vlog, man, and get that out there. But um, I'm going to do a video tomorrow, possibly, 
well, the, uh, I'm gonna start putting you know the series up again. Um, I just been home a little bit and enjoying my time or whatever. But I'm gonna start putting the series up uh, starting tomorrow. But anyway, I love y'all. Have a blessed and peaceful night rest. Or if you're watching during the day, have a blessed and peaceful day. I love y'all. Peace.